Hello everyone. I've got a really easy part part whole game for you to play. So all you need to do is draw yourself a part part whole. Here it is. So the whole means the whole of the number, all of a number, the total. And we're going to then work out what parts go together to make the whole. You need some counters and some number cards. I've made my own just by writing them. So what you do is you pick a number. Now I think these ones are mainly... <gasps> what? Mainly um, team numbers to help me practice my team numbers. But you could use any number that you want. So I've got 20 and we're going to put 20 counters onto your hole or however many you got. And then what you do is you move some of the um, counters to this circle and some to this one and you can move them however you like you could move them all into one maybe move one over there or you could move them uh, a little bit more like this so now I've got 20 is my whole, and I've got one part that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and one part that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now, if you want to, you can write that next to your circles, like you see on Number of the Day, if you've watched Number of the Day videos. Um, but that means you can't reuse your... Um, part part whole so instead you might want to write them on um, a piece of paper to help you remember or what you can do is move them again and find out what else one two three four five six seven eight nine ten is a part and one, two, three, ten is a part and the whole is 20 so we can say that 10 add 10 makes 20 you can say um, that 20 take away 10 is 10. And if we have a different number here, so we can explore all the different pairs that make 20 or, or that make your number that you get here. So I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So now I can say 12 is a part and 8 is a part. And together they make 20. Or I can say 8 add 12 makes 20. Or I can do subtractions and say 20 take away 12 is 8 and the other way around. Uh, what you can also do is, if I move all my counters off, you can do it the other way around. But with this you might want to just be careful with um, the numbers that you pick so that they're not too big. And what you can do is if you pick two numbers, you can have these numbers as your um, parts. So 13, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 13 is a part and oh, 2 is a part. And then, when you want to find out what they make together, what's the whole, you just move them all over into the whole. And then you know that 13 is a part, 2 is the part, and the whole is 15. 15 is the whole and 13 is a part and 2 is a part. Anyway, have fun with your numbers.